Hey guys, this is NDM here bringing you another episode of Let's Play Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Road Rescue Team. Okay, in the last episode, I've been confused by a friggin' Zubat. Oh crap. You can piss off, dude, seriously. I, I don't want you, but. Yeah, use that. Use a track. No, don't attack. Oh, you dumbass. No, I can't even move properly. It's just moving all over the place. I wasn't even controlling that then, it was just like doing whatever it wanted to do. Moving in its own pattern. Anyway, we um got to Lapras Cave in the last episode and this dungeon does it apparently this dungeon's not so tough, so we haven't really got that much to worry about. I think the strongest enemy in here would probably be a Lapras if there is a Lapras in here. Which, by the sounds of things, probably is because this is Lapras Cave after all. There probably will be some Laprases somewhere. Um, well, somewhere along the way, but. We're only on the first floor, and uh, I don't know how many floors there are. I think there are about 10, I'm not sure. I know this dungeon isn't entirely big, because, I mean, it is only a cave. It's... Shit, damn it. Great. Wonderful. Well, I'm not even going to attack right now. I'm just going to... Apparently you can switch... I don't know what tactics do. Um... Let me just see up. Because I heard you can switch your team. Just attack, dude. So. Fuck. I'm not even going to attack right now because there'll be no point because I'll end up attacking him. And I don't want to be doing that, so. I won't bother. Right, let's speed this up. So we can just get to the stairs and go to the next floor, I guess. Shit. Block my way, dude. That's not cool. Get out. Yeah, that's what I said, bitch. That's what I said. Well, I do, I do have, like, a little mini LP planned, but it will be during this LP because, I mean, seriously, it's only going to take, like, five episodes, and it's just for fun. It's just for shits and giggles. Uh, it's not like a adventure game. It's more of a fun game kind of thing. It's not like this kind of game. It's not an RPG or anything. It's nothing too big. It'll take about five episodes at least. Just five. Maybe four, I don't know. It all depends how many games there are on it. You'll see what it is. It is for the, well it's not for the same system as what I'm playing on playing right now, but oh, for fuck's sake, I hate these guys the way how they keep using confusion. Stop it. That's probably the only downside about this. Dungeon, those guys keep using fucking shitty confusion, which isn't doing so very, which isn't doing a very good number on me, I tell you. Oh, right, that's a dead end, I don't want to go that way. I imagine that's a dead end up there, too, so I'm not going to bother going up that way. Wow. Stop using. Oh, for fuck's sake. Just piss off, dude. Leave me alone. And those Zubats can go away because I'm fed up with them as well. To be honest. How about you eat confusion? Yeah, take some of your own medicine. Whore. Bitch. I'm not going to pick up that gravel rock because there's no point. I mean, well, actually there is, but... Oh, fuck it, I might as well. I mean, I... Uh, I have plenty of space left in my inventory, I think. I just don't want to be clogging that up, you see. 
confusion because that's super effective for some reason even though you're a psychic Pokemon I think I think they're psychic or they're dark either one yeah fucking taste your own medicine yeah you can use that the gravel rock if you want to Charmander Keep going down around here, I guess. Wow, this dungeon really isn't so big. I mean, it's not big compared to what all the other dungeons were, like, um, friggin' Sinister Woods or places like that, like, you know, Mount Thunder and shit. I mean, those dungeons are pretty s small, considering. Well, I guess the falls get bigger as you go along, so I don't know. This dungeon could pro progressively get bigger each time, because that's what it looks like it's doing. And those things can friggin' poison you, so I want to stay away from those. Exactly. For those reasons. So you better go find those stairs, huh? Shit. I don't know where these stairs are gonna... Because I don't want him to die, you see. It's probably going to end up happening if I don't... Oh. Never mind. I'm avoiding you because I don't really want to fight you. Because you'll probably end up taking damage from me and... I also want to leave dungeons, is it? I was hoping this place wouldn't have those. But I guess every dungeon will have those from now on. This stupid water... Shit on the outside. Who designed this dungeon? Seriously, I need a rhino. Oh god, this guy's been poisoned. Good thing I know psychic, which is super effective on these guys. So that's not much of a problem. Yeah, shit amount of EXP in here so far. I mean, I haven't gained like a hundred EXP or anything like that so far. Illumis. These guys can't be that powerful. Nah, not so bad. We could get this dungeon probably done in one episode, which is kind of surprising, really. Because. Normally it takes me about two episodes to do one dungeon, but this one I think I could do probably in one video. If I speed up like this on some occasions. And we're being chased by another friggin' Illuminous, whatever these guys are, I'll use Dig on this. I don't know if Dig's gonna do anything. Wow! Holy shit! I did 111 damage. I was not expecting that, but. Oh well, I'll take anything. Like that. Dude, stop using stomp on me. Bitch. No, this dungeon really isn't that big. I, was, I am actually surprised. And I don't really think there's that many falls left to go. I think there's like 13. Thir I, I did say there's like 13 or 10. Yeah. I mean, if this dungeon went on for 99 falls, which is... Which doesn't happen until like the, in the after game, which I'm not going to show you because the after game is ridiculously long. Um, and besides, we can't even do the after game because we haven't captured Zapdos, so I can't show you everything in the after game. Because there are certain dungeons you can't access. Well, there is a dungeon you can access, but you need to have. Um, we need to have all legendary birds, and that's to get Lugia. I'm gonna dig, because Dig did quite good damage on you. Well, it did last time, what the fuck? It took 111, and now it only took 50 some. I don't know what number that was, I was, wasn't paying any attention. I need to gain some more EXP, I need to level up, seriously. 
I don't know how, I don't know what, how much more EXP I need until I gain my next level. I haven't checked that recently. Confusion! Yes. Right, let's check how much more EXP I need until my next level. How much? Oh, 2,863, that's quite a lot. <laughs> hmm. I believe we're nearly done with this place now. Yep. Not that much long left. Oh shit, no, please. No. Ugh. I don't want that to happen to me. Because that always seems to always happen in these friggin' dungeons. It's not fun. And it happened. It's just happened. It just happened. Go away! Charmander, stop blocking me. God damn it. Eat. I could just wait for an enemy to come, but. Like that, and then just. Wait for him to fight, and then just move down. As he's fighting, and then just get back on the. No, he follows me still. What the hell? Oh, for fuck's sake. Fine, I'll swap places with you. But if you get fucked in the ass, I'm going to have to come and save you. Well, I am going to come save you anyway, so it doesn't really matter. I think he's heading towards me. Is he? Looks like it. Yeah, come back up here. Come back to me. Yes. Alright, so let's just go down these stairs. Um fed up. Well, there's no point in exploring this floor, because you know why? We're not going to be able to level up from this place anyway, because the amount of shit XP they give in this dungeon. I think this is like the strongest this place is going to get. Turns out there isn't going to be a Lapras, well maybe there might be like on the last few floors, but oh, for fuck's sake. Whatever, just piss off, go away. I'm fed up with you, Charmin. You always seem to ditch me every single time. So you fight your own battles because I'm pissed off with you. <laughs> All you seem to do is just run away from me. I'm just going to dig it. Well he's coming to me anyway so it doesn't really matter. Yeah, it's... Well he's not coming to me. Well no he is coming to me. Good. Yeah, like I said, there's no point in really me even doing all these or showing you the whole entire dungeon. Because do you know why? We're not going to level up from this place. And do you know why that is? Whoa, dude. Ah! You shithead! You fucking bitch! No! That friggin' bagel. Damn it. I'll meet you guys back on the, on the ninth floor again, so I'll see you guys then. Okay guys, we're back again. We're back on the ninth floor. Uh, I didn't gain any levels, sadly. I'm just gonna try and fucking kill this guy, because this guy's fucking using gravel rock. Whatever this guy's using, I don't know. Bunch of shit. Yeah, using gravel rock. I must have picked that up from somewhere. Probably from that room over there. Well, this floor isn't that big. Jesus. Confusion. Dig. Well, let's go with dig. I don't know what dig's gonna do on this guy, but hopefully a light arm. That was pants. At least he leveled up. Leveled up to level 20. That means I must not be so far from leveling up. I don't know how far I'm from leveling up, actually. Uh. Wow. Shit, you surprised me there, dude. Well, he's grass type. Ember would do good on him. Or a fire move or anything. Um. Let's see. Team. Summer. Oh, 1430. Yeah, it's not that bad. can't be that much, there can't be that much floors left of this place. Dig won't do, oh, whoa. Dig, dude, dig, did do a lot of damage. 
Oh, I want to get rid of something for that max elixir. Uh, because that's kind of needed. So I'm going to get rid of this uh, stamina band. I don't really need that. I'd rather have the max elixir and have PP than have a shitty stamina band. So, oh crap, I'm hungry? Really? Yeah. I'll use the big apple. Because that'll fill me right up. So then I don't have to keep using apples and I've been put to sleep. Wonderful. Wake up, you bastard. Wake up. Wake up, you homo, homo Simpson duck. I guess that makes sense. <laughs> homo Simpson duck. Jump. Yeah. 71? Really? Wow. Uh, you guys don't really have that much... HP, do you? Only 71 HP, and you give quite a lot of nice. Well, you give quite, quite nice EXP. Wow, this floor is huge compared to the other floors I've been on, dude. Like, uh, yeah, you would, you would put me to sleep, you tangle up bitch, you spaghetti o. You, you spaghetti ball of shit with funky shoes funky red shoes and that still killed you wow we got two we got two bagels oh why do I call them bagels? they're called bagons <laughs> or bagons What was I calling them? Oh, I don't know. Wow, there's 11 floors. I thought this dungeon was a lot shorter. Hidden power. Uh, I don't know who's going to use that. Because I want to teach that to someone. Because that would... Wait, items... Use... Swap. Swap for sleep seed, and then use. I think it'd be better if I learned that because I have shit moves. So forget water sport is crap. No water sport is crap. I don't want it. Yeah, hidden power. Mewtwo can learn hidden power on um Pokemon Far Red, but. Hidden power, as far as I I don't know if hidden power does anything. Let's try it out. See what it does. Oh, it does do something. As far as I know, it just like does. Oh, well, it doesn't do that much damage. I'd be better off using psychic or something like that, but I don't have any PP on psychic, so I can't use that. I have to use crappy scratch move. Come on, I should nearly level up not by now. Or nearly had leveled up by now. Damn it! Stop using sleep on me. That's like the first move you use on me is like sleep powder. So Stop using it. Super effective. Super effective. Oh come on, dude! There, there can't be like 20 floors of this place. That'd be ridiculous. Um, I'm gonna use the max elixir now, I think, because that's gonna be needed at a time like this, in a situation like this. I might just end the episode now because this is gonna drag on for quite some time. But these dungeons has this dungeon hasn't been so long. To be perfectly honest with you, it actually hasn't. Compared to all the other dungeons. But I don't know how long I've been recording for, so I might as well just end the episode here. In the next episode we'll be finishing off Lapras Cave and getting out of this place and find out what's going on next. So yeah. 
Until then, this is NDM saying thanks for watching and goodbye.